All right, so what's going on YouTube? What I wanted to do was uh, show you a brief video on how to get your machine back up and running and your complete control, whatever you have, back up and running under Yosemite. As you can see right here, I do have a Mac that is running Yosemite and I could not get this thing to open up at all until I ran across uh, some information online, which I'll provide you the website right here and it basically uh, told me what needed to be done and I went ahead and uh, did that and the steps uh, did work so what I did was I went into finder go into documents and if you right click on documents show and close folders if you go to library audio and then you go into your plugins if you look under how in that folder, you should see a plugin that says Avid Core Audio Plugins. I've already taken it out, placed it on my desktop um, in a plugin folder so that I know where it's at in case I do need to put that uh, plugin back in. From my understanding, what it, that works with uh, Pro Tools 10. So if you're not running Pro Tools 10, such as myself, which I'm running Pro Tools 11, it shouldn't be a big, uh, big issue. Um, so if you look, I'm gonna launch machine. You see, now machine opens. And uh, let me back up a little bit. Um, before, once you remove that plugin, just make sure that you um, restart your computer, and um, then try to open up machine, which everything should work the way it was working when you had uh, Mavericks on your computer. So, as you can see, I do have audio coming out of the machine everything is working the way it was before um, no issues also I already opened it up but my Pro Tools 11 is still open um, everything is working the way it was before so you see Pro Tools 11 no issues there uh, audio is working also So again, this is just a quick fix until, you know, Native Instruments and Avid get everything together to give us a patch that'll make everything work the way it's supposed to. But as you can see, I have complete control, uh, same thing. It opens up, everything's working the way it's supposed to work or the way it was working when I had Mavericks installed. Again, I don't take any credit for this uh, information that I've given you. Just wanted to show and share so that everybody can get back up and running. But again, this is the website where you can get the information from. I hope this helped you. Uh, if it did, just like the video. Thank you.